Okay, now we're going to go to the uh, flue opening. Now this is where the combustion gases come out of the boiler and uh, start to go over to the chimney. This is an 8 inch. On the K6, your flue opening is uh, 8 inch. Okay, now keep in mind everybody's flue is different. Everybody's install is different. Uh, you install this to what 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 your installation is uh, required. I mean, every, like I said, everybody's different. Not not every one's the same. So here we're just doing a, a quick, simple mock or to uh, demonstrate how we how we do it here at Keystoker. That could be changed. It could be moved around. It, However your application is, that this, this here could be spun. Every application is different. Uh, then you would set your draft. You would set your draft according to, uh, to the manufacturer's specs with this little dial right here. We like to set them at point negative two. And uh, that's usually generally where, where you want to have it. And uh, that's usually where you get a nice clean burn with your coal. But in order to get your, your draft correct, you gotta make sure you adjust this here, uh, this weight accord, uh, accordingly to get your uh, negative draft. You never want a positive draft, you always want a negative draft. Okay, and the scale, here's your numbers here, and there's your crimp mark that corresponds with that setting. So if you move it out there by that crimp mark and clamp it down, you're at 0.02 inches of water draft. Now this shaft here for the the uh, door has to be level, has to be horizontal. So once you get your flue pipe rotated the way you want it, then you this sits in here and can rotate. And you rotate this so this shaft is uh, perfectly level. Yes, it will not work properly if we have it on an angle like I did here before. This has to be perfectly level in order for this weight to work properly.